Yeah, a lot of them, Kelly. You know, the S&P healthcare sector hits another record high today, but it's been a different story for high-flying health tech firms in particular that have gone public this year. The latest example, genetic testing firm 23andMe, down 5% since listing via Richard Branson's Virgin SPAC just a week ago. Then there's longtime unicorn Oscar Health, which sank 10% in its March debut. It's trading in bear market territory, down more than 40% from its IPO price. And hims and hers, not a very pretty chart there. The telehealth platform, which this week acquired a tele teledermatology firm, also in bear market territory, down more than 35% since listing in January. Part of the problem, Credit Suisse analyst Jalindra Singh told me recently, is that investors are still trying to get to know these SPAC listed firms after the fact. For Clover Health, well, that has meant a roller coaster ride. Short sellers have questioned the financials of the tech enabled Medicare provider that listed through Chamath Palapatia's SPAC in January. Shares were pummeled back in February. Short positions rose. They're at about 36%, according to FactSet, which then made Clover into a meme trade play. You see that jump there in the beginning of June, squeezed higher over six straight sessions earlier this month, but now it's been down again 10 of the last 13 sessions and still down about 16% from its listing. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.